Hey guys, what's up? It's Kinsey and welcome back to my channel. So I got back from Mexico for a week long vacation last night and then before that I was in Palm Springs So I basically have been gone for like a week and a half I wanted to share with you guys my post vacation routine. This can also be used for like a weekend if you've been like Partying bopping around town, you know, this is kind of just my routine to get my life back together Be sure to subscribe if you guys have not already and follow me on Instagram if you guys want to see any of my pictures from Mexico I would love it if you guys did I waited for this to be so candid like my apartment is actually a mess right now and my suitcase is out and like if you know me You know, I hate when my apartment is a mess So I had to just like stare at it this morning. It's really been driving me insane anyways we're gonna get started into this video. So before I clean, I'm going to apply a face mask so I can wear it while I clean. I have like a hundred face masks, it's actually ridiculous. But I always make sure to apply a hydrating one because when you travel or when you're on a plane or anything, it really dries out your skin. So I'm always sure to like apply like a hydrating face mask before, sometimes during and after, because I'm a little bit crazy. It feels so good, but it looks so weird. My suitcase isn't allowed to even like pass my entryway in my apartment when I get back from trips. I just immediately throw everything into the laundry machine, so that's what I'm gonna be doing. Normally, I would do it literally upon walking into my door because that's how annoyed I get, but like I said, I wanted this to be candid, so I waited a whole night. My suitcase is like literally, ugh, it's, it's so big. I feel like Molly with the suitcase, honestly. So please ignore the washer and dryer, I'm sorry. But I have this much trash right now because when you come back from trips, there's just like a lot of PR packages and I've also made a lot of Amazon Prime packages just like randomly. So I'm gonna take out all this trash and like declutter and clean. Life hack. Cleaning takes like way less time than you think it does. If you set a timer and you focus and you get it done, you can literally do everything in like 20 minutes or at least I can in a one bedroom apartment. And I guess it never like gets that messy. But my point is that you should set a timer and clean because it changes the game, guys. Something that I've been doing a ton lately is I've been using my essential oil diffuser, my aromatherapy diffuser. Okay, I'm sorry for the noise, but I got my groceries delivered because I just this would be the time when I go grocery shopping and I have to film six videos today and I have people coming in town and I just don't have time, so I got them delivered. I have four bags because I have like literally no food and I need to be eating healthy. So that's what we're doing. So this is what I got from the grocery store. Comment down below if you guys want me to do a healthy, inexpensive, like, grocery haul. Especially for people who are, like, just moving out or in college or whatever. But I got a lot of stuff. I my face mask on, but now I'm just going to shower and self-tan. But now I'm going to listen to a podcast. I'm trying to pick one right now. I like to do this and listen to a podcast or, like, music or have, like, my diffusers and candles and stuff going as soon as I get back. Because sometimes... For some reason, every time I get back from a trip, I feel weird, and I, this has been my entire life. Doesn't matter where I live, I don't know what it is. But to combat that, I like do things that make me happy. I'm gonna shower. I'm gonna do like the full routine. So this is when I'm like really treating myself when I have time for it. So I just took a shower and I self tanned. I look really orange, like not in person, but because this is orange, I promise. Then I went in with the It's a Tan Miracle Leave-In product, which I do every single time. This stuff is amazing and. Yeah, I have to wait two hours for this to dry before I can get ready, so I'm just gonna go get more stuff done. I'm almost done, which will be good, and I can resume with my normal life. Okay, so now the last thing I have to do, actually I have two more things to do, is I make a to-do list of all the things that I need to do throughout that week. To be honest with you, I normally do this on the plane, but I'll write it all down and I'll have it all like out visually, because it just makes me get things done a lot better. And then I will plan out my week in my passion planner. I always do a to-do list before I go in with my passion planner. I have an entire video on how I do my passion planner and stuff. I get to ask that a ton, and I do have a video on it, so I'll have that link down below. Thank you, Coconut. Then I'm just ready to take on my week. I hope you guys enjoyed this post-vacation routine, and I hope that it helps some of you guys. Comment down below if you guys have anything that you do that is different than mine. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a little bit different than what I've done before, but you guys seem to love my routine. So I love you guys so much, and I will see you soon. Bye.